Hey guys, PK Sparks the Hotness here. Welcome back to Let's Play Banjo Kazoo. Whoa! I like how Banjo just like did a 180 there. He's like, we're ready to go in, brother. I'm not gonna hold you up any longer, Banjo. We're gonna go in. What is this? She can barely fit in that thing. She's like a big donut. What is that? I'd rather have a construction. Oh my god, she's like, oh my her neck? How can any neck contort like that? It must have like the elasticity of a thousand yum yum gums or whatever. What is that? No! And he has a club foot! Why does he have a club foot? What could have done? What 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 could have happened to him? What could have happened to Klungo that caused him to be so deformed? His eyes! His teeth! His horrible breath! His skin! Klungo! No! There he is! The fun begins! My tricks and traps will see who wins! Alright, so, go up here and guess what this is. Hey, it's me, Mr. Jiggy. Now go and find my picture with a piece missing. One down, 99 to go. Let's do this. So, um, this is going to be a relatively quick LP. I'm going to be aiming to do 10 puzzle pieces in one episode. That's my goal. I'm going to be doing this. Alright. To win in the world shown in picture, you must fill in the missing spaces with the jigsaw pieces. We've got the first jigsaw piece, Goggle Boy. Great. To fill in the missing pieces on a picture, press A. If you don't want to use any jigsaw pieces, press B to leave. A. That's it! The picture's complete! And the door to Mumbo's Mountain is open! That was such an easy fit! The others may just test your wit! <laughs> Alright! Mumbo's Mountain! Now, one of my favorite things about this stage is that... Uh, oh yeah, in each, each world we're going to be gaining new... Um, well, there's a few things here. See this? These are Jinjos! Yippee! You saved me! Godzilla has imprisoned five of us Jinzos on each world. Free us all to get a Jiggy. So that's one thing we gotta do. We also gotta collect these Mumbo tokens, which are definitely important. I mean Mumbo token. Use for Mumbo magic. Who the hell is Mumbo? We will find out later on. Alright, so there's another um, Jinjo. Uh, I'm a note. One of a hundred, one of a hundred of each world. Collect us to open the note doors. So yeah, they're kind of important. We got another jiggy down here. We're gonna go down here and grab these. I, I, this game is. I like this game. I don't know how this game. Nintendo, how can you let this thing um like slip through your hands? This game is such a masterpiece. It's, I'm telling you, the N64 had the greatest platforming of any system. I don't care what you say. God, the sound. It's like. It's kind of hurting my ears, actually. God, that's 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 a real sound. That's what I'm talking about. Yay, HD. All right, so we gotta get up here. So we gotta find Mumbo. We gotta find him a few places that way we can um um get our new moves so we can f complete the stage. So here's a few things we're gonna do. We're gonna find Mumbo first. I mean, Mumbo. Um, who did we just say? Bottles, we're gonna find bottles. Sissel Pud is online. Hi, Sissel Pud! Should probably turn that off when I'm doing this. I'm this is my first Xbox 360 LP, so I'm kind of new to this. So yeah, there's definitely a puzzle piece just sitting there. Get up there! Oh, we almost had that. Oh! Screw you, bottles! We don't need your ability! There's a mumble smoking down there. We're gonna run around here and grab oh, there's a ginger. And we're gonna grab this. You must search for 10 of us on each world. We'll help you progress through the witch's lair. Dirt, dirt. That hurt the dirt, dirt. Alright. When you're ready to leave this world, return to the start area and stay on the exit pad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know why you tell us that I only got one puzzle piece. We have, what, nine more to go? Where are the eggs? Because then we can learn us, to, learn, us to, to learn to use us as ammo. God, I cannot speak. Alright, so, uh, where is Bottles? He's, oh, here he is. Yeah, we definitely need him for this, because this is important. 
The Talon Trap will let Kazooie's tackle steep slopes with ease. This sounds useful. How does she do it? Hold the right trigger, then press the left trigger. Continue to hold the right or left trigger while moving Kazooie around with the left stick. Go practice! Yes! My favorite ability and most used ability in this game. So now we can uh, tackle these steep hills. Because if we didn't have this one otherwise, we would do that. So we kind of need the Talon Trap. So now with the Talon Trap, we can walk on these hills. Yippee! You've collected enough notes to break the first note door. Spell. <laughs> I hate it when it comes slowly because then I speak like broken. Stupid. But anyway, so we're gonna grab these, get up there. Get. There we go. Alright. So we got that. Grab these. Whoa, whoa. We're like over halfway done. We're just collecting all these notes. I wonder if we, I don't think we get uh, a puzzle piece for collecting all the notes. So this sort of we're missing. Um, oh yeah. See that? What? There you go! I need that aim congo for a chungo, chunky kong. There it is! <laughs> That's so easy! Clever bear fight chungo's gold. Boo, boo, boo! Ba -do, ba -do, boo, boo, uh boo! -huh. I love it! I love it! Alright, oh wait, wait, wait. I remember this part. I remember this part. We gotta run up here and. Grab that! Run away! Ow, oh, he hit us! Or actually, we hit him and he like stopped us. Yum, oranges are nice. Oh, Chip, you like Chungus orange. Chip would help fat bear and burn. Bitch, you're fat. You're the one wanting something to eat. My, my fault. I kind of got voted there for a second. For a second, but I caught myself. But you, but you, boo. Go, huh? So now we got to back up up here, and guess what? Well, actually, we're going to go over here for a second. Eat them, buck them. Grab that, grab that. Then we gotta. Oh, we didn't learn it yet! Kind of flab it. Alright, so we will be back here in a second. Uh, I hate it when ground pounding isn't an uh, innate ability. Time for the buzzer to use the ancient ways of the age. I'm listening, Beetle Breath. <clears throat> Hold the right or left trigger, then press Y to shoot an enemy out of your mouth. Hey, sounds cool. Anything else? Sure. Press B instead and you'll shoot him up from behind. Jeez, sounds painful. Wish I never asked. Bird brain can carry 100 eggs in her backpack. Oh, and you can also use the left stick to aim while you are crouching. Exciting, huh? Now that you learn to use the eggs, here's 50 to practice with. Hmm, your energy is a bit little low. I'll fill it up for you. Thank you, kind sir. You are very kind. I'm just going to take these eggs as well. It doesn't matter. So we gotta shoot him. He doesn't see us at all. Oh, crap, he's off. You mad, son. You mad. Uh. Yo, yo, wait. Oh, here we go. He got it. Whoa! Whoa! You can't shoot twice. Get him! You mad, son. Uh, bear beat Congo. Me give prize to bear. And he just... Well, maybe that's why he had a bad back. Because you're keeping a puzzle piece in your back. I'm pretty sure that's not healthy. Do, 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 do. Ba -do, ba -do, ba -do. Four down, six to go. Let's do this. All right, so we completed all over here besides that switch that we're going to be doing on a later date. Not a later date, but a later time. Like, I don't know, maybe 10, 15 minutes from now. So uh, now we got that, we have one... Oh, wait, no, there's a puzzle piece all the way over there. Let's run and get that. Yeah, we have to do this hill as well. Actually, now that I mention it... Crap, I missed! Crap, I missed! Man, uh, cause I mean that's that's that hill is actually a little too steep even for Kazooie to get with the um with the talent trot. So you gotta like fall in there. So I'm gonna have to try. Can we zoom? Yeah, we can't zoom out. All right, so I'm gonna try that again. I'll see you guys at the top of this hill. You know, what? actually, we're gonna attack it from right here. Let's try it from right here. Oh, we did it! All right, um, that's another honeycomb piece. You can't collect. Um, you, you can raise your health to 8. You have to collect it twice. Uh, well, no, no, you, there's 12 to collect, I believe, or maybe there's more. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure there's 12 and you can raise it twice. Maybe you can raise it three times, I'm not quite sure. But, um, basically you can find them honey clones throughout the world. There's two in each, and there might be some in the overworld. Hold on. 
Do 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 uh, so we have 20 more to collect, and I think we're about to learn the fourth move, or the third move in this world, right here. You can book. I think that, oh, there's a puzzle piece right here. Let's grab this puzzle piece. Do 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 I should probably stop saying just puzzle piece and call it what it is. A freaking jiggy. Nyahahaha. <laughs> Let me just tackle you. There it is, this is what I was looking for. Mmm, I'm sticky tasty. Honey energy. Brrrr. I call this the Big Buster. Jump into the air, then press right or left trigger to sink until he's slamming down hard to the floor. I don't like the sound of that, Banjo. Get used to it, Ness Girl. You'll be using it a lot. Whoa, Banjo, there's nothing more I can teach you on this world. Alright, so that was basically a ground pound. See, something basic that we should have had a long time ago that we just didn't because it's. it's I don't know. I don't know. Banjo just sucks. He has no coordination. But anyway, we're here now. Grab that. Then we're gonna get these eggs. Bow, 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 bow. I should probably be using the talent trust a lot faster. No, no, backflip. Get up there. Oh, enemy, enemy, kill him. I like the backflip in this game a lot better. Oh, there's a Jinjo there. Hey, that's the fifth one. Oh, so, yeah, fifth one. We have three more to go. We are tackling this stage. Then again, this is the first stage, so I don't want to get too cocky and then end up being a new in later episodes because then I'm just going to be a really new because I have been dragging and now I'm sitting here doing nothing. Two more to go. I know where one is and we're going to get it right now. So, this is something interesting. It's the uh, second honeycomb piece you can find in this world. Show you guys this in a second. Get up there and back up again. We juju. Mumbo's token for the and blue stones. Yeah, we've already been doing that. Do 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 do. Ba do ba do ba do. All right. So now that we got that. There's one more thing we gotta do. And before we do that, we're going to go over there and hit that witch switch. So I'll see you guys over there in a second. Let's get climbing! Uh, don't fail! Don't fail! Okay, we got it. Ground pan! And these switches bring out a secret puzzle piece that we can find later on. Uh, it's basically like puzzle pieces. Jigsaws! Jiggies! Jiggies! I gotta say that! Jiggies! Freaking jiggies! They're jiggies, not puzzle pieces! Why am I saying puzzle pieces? <laughs> but anyway, um, I should probably calm down a little bit. I'm just really excited to be doing this game. But, um... Basically, they're jiggies, and those switches reveal jiggies that you can find in the overworld. That you go, you gotta get them a special way. You gotta find them or whatever. Uh, hey, those puzzle people, uh, those things they here. Me, Mumbo, best shaman in all game, can help Banjo on filthy feathered one. Watch it, hot boy. Mumbo's magic token is hit by witch. Find tokens, and Mumbo will help you. Banjo not got enough tokens from Mumbo magic. Look at sign. Bring more. Wait, I missed one? What did I miss? Oh wait, wait, I think I would have flipped this. Get up there. Get up there. Alright, now we got to flip again. See if I'm right. Did I grab the one that was under the steps? Look at my god. I could have sworn I grabbed it. Huh, guess I'm wrong. Just run back out. Just try to find this thing. Okay, so it turns out the fifth one was actually in the little ant hole, ant hill that we were go trying to go to. Banjo has plenty of tokens. They don't scroll and press X to see Mighty Mumble Magic. Basically, we're paying him with these things. Winga, winga, winga. Boogaba! <laughs> Mumble's magic free chain back. So basically, we can just chain that for free. Turn my bit small, but not bad for first spell. Mumble's practice now. Something like that. Anyway, so now I'm going to show you guys the anthill where we found the fifth Mumble token. Um, in case you guys didn't notice that, Mumbo changes us. Now we're one of them, so I think it's to hurt us. Yeah, it is to hurt us, but they don't attack us. Hey, where did they get those shorts? I want them! So basically, we need this anthill thing for two reasons. Well, not anthill, but this little ant version. Got to turn around. Come on, Cam. Oh yeah, the camera angle is like static in this place. So anyway, we need it except because 
The ant can actually uh, stand slopes that even Kazooie's talent track can't even handle. Um, out! Yay! You fell all 100 notes on this world. Well done. So yeah, basically this is why we needed it because the uh, only the ants can do this. So we got to transform into an ant and we can go up this anthill. Really cool pl uh, platform and mechanic. I love it. I love Nintendo. I love Rare. I miss the Nintendo Rare combination. Uh, but you know, things happen when you work Earth. So we get up here and, well, there's a life. We should probably grab that. Go. Uh -huh. I like, uh, yeah, I don't know what I'm about to say. Anyway, here is our fifth puzzle piece. And we are on top of the mountain. That's what I'm talking about. That's how we do it. Time for the ultimate fanfare. Ants' legs are actually really tough for some reason. Like, they don't die. Like, you can fall from any height and you don't get hurt. It's kind of cool, actually. All right, so before we end this episode, I'm going to show you guys the secret um, to finding that... Basically, the ant hill can climb these mountains. Right there. We can climb this with, with the ant. Climb it, climb it. Got it. We got our second jungle thing. And not jungle, but um, um overworld jiggy. Hey, where did you get those shorts? I wonder, yeah, we already said that. We're all jealous. Anyway, so you go far you go too far from the world and will magic get weak and it will turn back or magic go. Basically saying you gotta stay close to the world because the the transformation is like kind of linked to Mumble's power. So the further you go from them, the weaker it gets. And if you get too far, magic all gone. Must go back to bear and bear it down. All right. So I'm gonna show you guys why we were collecting the notes, and we're going to end this episode. So we're gonna come up here. We need the talent trot, so we had to go to that world. And see that? That is a well. Let's let um Bottles explain it. This is a note door, sealed by Grunty with one of her power, powerful musical spells. Open it up then, jam jars. It's not this simple. To open it, you must collect the magical notes from the worlds. How many do we need? The number on the door is the strength of the spell. The combined total of all your best note scores from the worlds must be at least this to break Grunty's magic. When you open a world door, bangs escape and roam once more. Hmm, your energy is a little low. I'll fill it up for you. Alright, and then we touch the door and go near it, and... That's it! So, we are going to end the epi second episode with the first world completed. And on the next episode, we will be entering that door. So I want to thank you guys for watching. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And stick around for the next episode of Let's Play Banjo-Kazooie. Until next time, guys, this is PK Sparks, the hotness, signing out.